Hey everybody, it's Scott, the Amateur Angler, and uh, go Leafs, Leafs in the playoffs, and happy Mother's Day everybody out there. So yesterday was the uh, walleye opener for our area here in southern Ontario, and it's the first time I've been out on the water since, I may have gone out October of last year, but it's been a long time and I was anxious to get out. Uh, the good news is I got out. The bad news is that it was a tough day on the water. Um, it was a high of 9 degrees Celsius with the wind chill, it was uh, below 6. Uh, extremely windy day out there, so uh, the, the fishing was tough in spots. Uh, the good news is though, the first fish of the year for me was a nice walleye, pulled it up uh, jigging. Uh, my brother Chris and I was out, picked up the walleye as well. Um, and this lake's not full of walleye, so any walleye is a, a good pick. But uh, we picked up some, uh, some crappie, we picked up some catfish, picked up some pike, and uh, you know, so it was a great day on the water. Anyways, uh, other things of course is you've got to get back in practice after almost six months off. So the knot tying skills got put to the test, the casting skills, uh, tried out some new lures, lost some new lures. So I've got a little video that I'll test this at the end where you can uh, Watch us poking a little bit of fun at ourselves after my brother's tying on some new knots while I, while I steer the boat. Anyways, hopefully you've enjoyed things out there. Uh, today it is Mother's Day and it is windy and stormy, so I'm glad we just picked up the one. I'm going to try and get out one more time this week on the local lakes here, and then this coming weekend it's also the opener uh, further north. So I'm going to try some other lakes up north, and again, my uh, goal here is to try out some new tools and new skills, see what I can pick up. Anyways, the boat held up, didn't leak, uh, had some new rod holders and stuff in it, so we had a great day. Anyways, enjoyed the rest of this video, and you see us actually in on the water poking a little bit of, a bit of fun at each other. Again, if you've got stories, share them with us, and uh, don't forget to check out the actual website, uh, theamateurangler.ca. Take care. Alright Chris, why don't you tell us what's going on here? <laughs> well, I am tying Scott a new union knot. Scott had a situation where he casted his scatter wrap into a really tall tree and my previous knot I guess didn't hold as he reefed it out of the tree so yeah. Scott doesn't know how to tie these so I'm going to do my best to set him up again so we can be ready to go. Alright so basically what happened here is I got a new uh, I got a new uh, Shimano Corrado reel, new scatter wrap. It was the uh, shad wrap, sorry, it was the uh, cranking wrap. And I casted it a lot uh, higher and further than I expected and yeah, it's in a tree. So it's gone, it's $10 gone. I estimate I had 10 casts with it before I lost it permanently. So anyways, we're out here on uh, Conestoga Lake on the uh, walleye pike opener. And uh, we have caught fish, not as many as we'd hoped, but cold front came in last night. It is about 9 degrees Celsius, uh, feels like 6. We're cold, and uh, we're going to go back and do some jigging because uh, we've had some luck on that. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Enjoy the opener.